good job coming to another video. Um, hopefully that cricket or bird or whatever the hell it is isn't too loud. I can hear it's annoying. But anyways, that was from the title of the video unboxing. So um, also I I don't know how I cut my hand before when I was sitting up for this video. I don't know what happened, but covered it up and toilet paper and tape for now, and I'll take care of it later. But anyways, um, yeah. So dude, I, I've been wanting this for a while. I've been wanting this for a good while now. Um, this is a character I've been like crazy about lately. Pro the guys are like right now, like this guy's like my favorite character easily for sure, without a doubt. Um, so yeah, I've been looking at this thing for not this exact copy, but just copies of this book right here. I've been looking at copies of this thing for, I don't know, like a whole month now or so I'd say. Um, finally decided to buy it. And yeah, so after I do is want to get into it. So this is from uh, mycontshop.com for anyone wondering. I'll go ahead and leave the link to their uh, site in the description. Um, I've been using their website for, I want to say almost two years now, actually. Wait, like a year, year, over a year, year and a half, something like that, I'd say. Um, real good site. I've never had issues with them. I've seen some people say that they've gotten like damaged books from them. So I don't know what's up with that. I've never had an experience like that with them or any kind of bad experience at all. So, yeah, I don't know what's up with that, but I mean, I've had, you know, nothing but good experiences with them. I bought from them over, over five times for sure, over five times. Um, it's actually bought from them. Usually when it comes to like big purchases like this, I usually buy this from like, um, like eBay. Um, I may or may not have just cut a part of the video off and y'all didn't hear what I was fully saying, but, um, to my slip was right there i don't want my address or anything showing but um anyways here it is so be careful with this thing on not trying to screw this thing up all right oh there it is there it is there it is there it is Now there are like two issues with this. I'll, I'll talk about it once I like get it out and whatnot. But um, there were things I was able to like you know, you know, be like whatever with like it's, that's fine. I can I can deal with it. But um, yeah, I was looking like I don't know three different copies or so of this book, and I just ultimately came down to um to this one. I thought it was like the best buy for sure. I thought it was like the best buy compared to the other things I was looking at. And there it is. All right, so um, I wanna show it to y'all real quick. Then I'm just gonna show y'all a picture on the, I don't know, like one of the, I don't know which side of the screen it's gonna be on. I'll show y'all a picture of it. So here it is. Daredevil number two. Second appearance of Daredevil, second appearance of Electro, and first crossover between <clears throat> First crossover between Matt Murdock and the Fantastic Four. The reason I say Matt Murdock, not Daredevil, um, and if I'm not mistaken, he becomes their lawyer in this issue. So I don't know if it was like actually like Daredevil, like in his suit, um, you know, crossing over with the Fantastic Four. But um, dude, this thing looks. Not, they uh they call us a 3.0. This looks pretty damn nice for a 3.0. Um. Let me take it out of the this bag. I want to take a look at it and whatnot. So, anyways, the two issues. I'll show. You, there should be like a picture on one of the sides of the screen right now. So, the two issues with the book are one. There's like a one and a half inch like spine split, and usually I like actively avoid comics with like spine splits. But I mean, if it's something like that or like smaller, then I can deal with it. It's whatever. Like my whole collection of like 1,100 something comics, I probably got like five or less comics with spine splits and this is one of them. Um, I just actively avoid that stuff. I mean, I made an exception for this, it's fine. And the other one is one that I'm really curious about and I have to like actually look for it here in a second. Um, adhesive residue. So I don't know like what happened with like Sometime throughout the years, someone put like a price sticker on this thing or whatever, like on the book. 
Um, I don't know, but anyways. Oh, it's literally, okay, that makes sense. Okay, it's literally like in a whole bag and board inside of this bag and board. Hold on, let me, how am I, hold on. I might have to tear this thing apart right here, there. Uh, is this thing taped in? I don't know what's going on. I think this thing is like literally taped up in here. Oh, hold up. Oh, this thing is stiff. What the? F hold on. That's the board. Hold up. All right. Take the board out first. Then I should be able to take this out. No, I can't. Okay. I don't know what the hell is. Is this thing taped in here? I've never encountered like anything like this before. And that says a lot because I've made like over like 40 purchase 40 different comic purchases on ebay um within the last like almost two years i'm just yeah i'm just gonna do this i don't, I don't even care i'm not using this thing anyways all right there we go okay there all right so got out of that now let me take it out there's this all right, i see the spine split it's that i can deal with it's fine but um but yeah, when it comes to Daredevil, like I said earlier, um, I've been on like an absolute Daredevil craze the past like few months or so, especially the last like month. Um, damn, that thing is. Uh, I need to be like real careful with this thing. This is literally like my oldest comic book now that I think of it. This came out in 64. I just don't know what uh, month. But um, dude, this is nice. I, I like it. I'm happy with this. It would definitely benefit from like a heat and press. I just don't know if I'll end up doing all that or not. What's this adhesive residue thing? Let me see. There's a part of the cover where I can feel like some kind of texture, like stickiness or whatever. Yeah, I don't know what, I don't know what they're talking about when they say adhesive residue. Yeah, this empty uh, top loader like right behind me. This is actually gonna be the, um, the replacement of what's going in there. But um, yeah, I think I did good. I think I did good. Um, which I didn't have to pay so much for this thing as much as I did. Um, I paid 500 something. I don't know the exact amount. It was 500 something. Um, but I mean, dude, we all know like um, this thing is only gonna go up. We all know that. Um, he's gonna be in She-Hulk. He's literally getting his own show. He's going to be an Echo. Probably going to be in other stuff as well throughout the years. Um, so, yeah, I mean, this is like, like, literally like the next best thing you could have when it comes to Daredevil. Um, speaking of this, actually, since I'm on the topic of this, I'm actually getting another uh, Silver Age Daredevil key. Um, literally, like, next week. Yeah, like, next week, Friday, I'll be getting it. Um... Really looking forward to it. It's a book I've been wanting. You no, know, it's a book I've been wanting even longer than this right here. I've been wanting it even longer than this. So, looking forward to that. But um, yeah, I think I did good. I mean, the spine split it sucks. It's it's definitely noticeable. Yeah, you can literally like see like the inside of the book and whatnot. But I mean, other than that, I think I did good. Um, I don't care too much for like the back cover as long as you're not like tape and huge chunks of it missing or whatever. But I mean, yeah, I'm happy with this. It's a decent looking cover. So yeah, yeah, I'm cool with this for sure. I'm happy with this. But uh, yeah, that's it for this video. Um, in October, actually, like it's probably more like the last video in October. Um, what my uh, comic shop does, my local comic shop, they do a half off sale. They do a 50% off sale for back issues. So. I'm literally just like saving between now and then, like just strictly saving and not spending like any money um, at all. Besides like new books weekly, obviously. Um, strictly saving, I'm just gonna go like on an absolute, just, uh, just full on just buying Daredevil, Daredevil only. So, and they, they be have an early age issue, Daredevil, Daredevil also like, like early like double digit issues and whatnot. They be having a bunch of double digit issues um and whatnot but uh, yeah yeah this is pretty good uh y'all know what y'all think about uh, this book and whatnot but yeah once again daredevil 2 second appearance of daredevil 
Second and Fiorento Leg Show, first crossover between Matt Murdock and the Fantastic Four. So yeah, that's that. But yeah, once I do that um, Daredevil Hall video at the end of October, um, I'm gonna be honest, it's probably gonna be like over 200, 250, maybe even 300. Probably so, I'm gonna be honest, it's probably gonna be like over 300. Uh, that, that's, uh, that's, no, that's a little crazy. It might, it might, it might need to be a two-part video to be honest. Um, we'll see what happens. We'll see, we'll see. But um, yeah, that's that. But uh, once again, let me know what y'all think of the book uh, in the comments and whatnot. Uh, let me know what y'all think of Daredevil. How hyped you are for him uh, to be in the MCU now? We've seen him in No Way Home as uh, Matt Murdock. We're about to see him in She-Hulk within I don't know a few weeks or so. And then we got Echo next year and the Daredevil show in 2024, which. I'm like beyond hype for 18 episodes is just insane. But uh, yeah, that's that. And I'll see y'all the next one.